Hi folks, Max from GalaxyS4Root.com. For this week's Verizon Galaxy S4 ROM of the Week, check out Bonestock ROM. Uh, this is, as the name of the ROM implies, Bone Stock. Um, but it does have a bunch of features you're going to like. And also this ROM is uh, based off the latest OTA ME7. So for those of you who want to be on the latest ME7 firmware updates, um, this is a great ROM and also very like stock and you do have choice of removing the apps you want in Aroma Installer which I'll show you at the end. Um, also you do get stuff like uh, app to SD so you can move to SD card very easily there. And also there should be an option for HDR in your camera now uh, with the latest update uh, which is really nice. HDR works actually really well on the Galaxy S4 um, simply because uh, it's just made for it. And, uh, you know, it's versus uh, the one on the, uh, the stock AOSP ROMs. Those are kind of, um, you have to actually use a tripod versus the AOSP, uh, versus the one on the, the Samsung firmware. It works well without a tripod. Uh, I've been testing it. So very nice. And also, uh, this does have ad blocking. And let me show you some of the stuff you can do. Um, here we go. Uh, you do have ROM control, um, so you can get AOSP lock screen if you want, which is nice, and uh, if you want to turn it off. And also torchlight, this is great. Um, you got the volume up key when the screen is off. You can set the timeout, uh, let's say 15 seconds. Um, you know, you're in the garage, you need a flashlight, uh, you're in the dark room, whatever. Um, go ahead and hold down the volume up button and keep holding it up. Oh, how come it's not working? Uh oh. That's weird. Let me try that again. Um, go ahead and do this. Volume up. There we go. It's working. Um, you might have to toggle it if it's not working at the first time. 15 seconds is going to stay on and it will turn off. And there you go. Um, and also a bunch of stuff you can do. Change the clock to center if you want. AM, PM if you need it. Small AM, PM. Days of week if you need it. Um, actually, I find that very useful. Um, sometimes I'm like... What day is it today? Like I'm getting too high on Android. So that's very helpful. If you want battery bar, uh, you might want to toggle this and show it and then it will show the battery bar. It's the thing at the top um, so you don't need the battery. Music controls, you can get um, some music controls. Um, you know, you can change uh, what the volume up does. You can make it pause, play, all that good stuff. When you're listening to music uh, in the BART, in the bus, that's going to be very good. Although I don't use it much. Long press to kill button, you can disable it or you can enable it for menu. Uh, that's great. If you're, on, uh, if you're on an app, sometimes it freezes, just hold down the uh, menu button and boom, it kills it. So nice basic functionality for UI based on ME7. Uh, very nice ROM and also native multi-window app uh, enabled for all apps. You know, there we go. Um, so any apps you add will show up here as you can see all my apps are in there um, so that's very nice this ROM is you know for those of you who want to be on the latest MEA stock firmware uh, but you know you want to remove some of the Verizon uh, bloatware as you can see I don't really have bloatware but I'll show you in a second and you want to get some good options uh, for your phone definitely this is the ROM for it uh, it's gonna let you keep the stock uh, the latest stock firmware plus uh, features while get re getting rid of the features you don't want. So let me go ahead and show you also the reboot menu there. Uh, let me actually, yeah, what was that? There we go. Um, let me go ahead and show you the actual Roma installer, which is really nice. I know a lot of you use Titanium Backup app, try to remove some apps. You end up in a soft brick or something breaks. You know, rather than doing that, just install this ROM and you'll be able to remove everything you don't want, um, customize it exactly the way you want. So this is a great ROM for those of you who want to stay stock on the latest firmware uh, with features, remove bloatware, um, you know, without having to, um, you know, have all that trouble. And also if you're on stock older versions uh, or ME7, whatever, you can install right on top of it without wipe. I actually went from an MDK stock firmware installed right on top of it, no problems at all. Um, so that is nice. And uh, let me go ahead and show you with my twerp recovery. Um, 
And Twerp is now re uh, available for the Verizon Galaxy S4 if you want it. You can download Goo Manager app and install it there. Um, you don't have to wipe unless you're coming from a, another custom ROM. Let me go ahead and install it. I'm just going to show you the Bone Stock Aroma Installer. Uh, here we go. And go ahead and click Next. Uh, Guri, Next. Uh, hit it again. Hit it again. And hit it again. Um, you can also, you know, after installing ROM, if you want to change some of the mods or apps or whatever, you can choose a second option. For the full install, choose the first option. And you can change, um, actually it does come with these extra keyboards if you want it, swipe or emoji. Uh, and also widgets, whatever widgets you want to choose, you can choose it here. And also live wallpapers, because these li live wallpapers take up a lot of space, um, you can choose not to install it like I did and also Google Apps um, you you can also download it on the Play Store uh, if you want and also Samsung apps so this is all the blower you can choose to install or uninstall or choose the ones you want uh, which is the beauty of bone stock ROM and also backup assistant I never use that so all right and here's some more misc applications pop-up browser if you want it Go ahead and hit next, and that will install it. I'm, I'm not going to install it because I just installed it. Uh, and I have the options that I want. Anyway, check it out for this week's Verizon Around uh, the Week ME7 firmware update with removed blower and also multi window native and some great features. Um, and do let me know what you think. And as always, uh, if you have a Galaxy S4, any of the Galaxy S4s, don't forget to sign up for my email list at the galaxyS4root.com. Uh, we update you once a week with Around the Week tip sacks and more. Uh, and also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button down there. And I will see you guys next week um, because i got to work on other phones now. <laughs> and uh, stay high on Android. And that's the boot up animation uh, pulled from the Google edition. So I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys soon.